Good day. Welcome to King William Rules Everything. Today we're going to take a look at a couple LED lights. I bought these probably, I'm going to say at minimum, eight years ago. And I bought these because this is when uh, LEDs were first coming out. And, you know, to get, a, get one in the U.S. was super expensive. And I knew the brightness was pretty crappy. You know, the early ones, they, they didn't even light up a hallway. They were good for like an accent light, maybe like, you know, just to keep like a night light. But they did work, and like, but like I said, they were very expensive. So I got these from China, and you know, something like this from the U.S. would be like, you know, twenty, thirty bucks. This was like three dollars, four dollars max. So you know, you're getting what you pay for. But what I did when I got these, um, I plugged this sucker in and I ran it for five years straight. I know the king sounds like he's crazy, but what I did, I took tons and tons of light bulbs, and I had um, didn't have to pay for electricity, so. What I would do, I just I wanted to see how long they would run. And literally, these these ran day and night for five years, unless, like, the power went out, something like that. But I did have them on a UPS for a while, but there were a few times where the power went out. So, you know, we did have some uh, times when these were not on. This one, this is the one that ran for five years straight. And you can kind of see you got some UV discoloration on this piece of plastic. So I'm assuming this is, this is different plastic. This one here I ran, um, I think it was kind of off and on in a hallway or something like that. So this one didn't run quite as much, but this one here ran all the time. So what we're going to do, we're going to turn these suckers on and see, you kind of get an idea of the brightness of these. And maybe we can get one apart. We'll probably take one apart. We'll snap this one apart and uh, take a look and see the brightness. So, uh, like you're going to see, like, you know, you used to an LED light now, um, you know, it lights up a room like a normal light bulb. These were like, you know, 100 lumen. Some 200 lumen, 150 lumen, something like that. You look at all these fancy LEDs in there. So these weren't that powerful, but, you know, they did work. And like I said, this was kind of like the earlier times of uh, LEDs for lighting. So let's uh, turn one on in the dark and see what it looks like. And then we'll rip this bad boy apart and see what's inside it. You kind of can see a little bit in there. There's not much in there, but, you know, it still works. So anyway, back in a minute. Okay, so it's kind of dark. Kind of see, it gives off some okay light. It's you know a very bluish light, but that was kind of typical of these LEDs. I won't shine it in your face like that, but you know you kind of get the idea. That's nice blue. And of course, it gets blue, but that's the way these LEDs were. Their LEDs weren't very white; they're bluish, and this one has a very deep uh, blue tint to it. But you know, like I said, if you just wanted some uh, accent lighting, or just you know, this would be good, like on a. Uh, you know, in a hallway or something that you want to keep on all the time, save some power. But for light, you know, you're not going to get a ton of light out of this sucker. You know, it is what it is for you know, that age and that price range. But anyway, you get the idea. Oh, uh, that's the antique, in modern terms, LED light. Hope you enjoyed it, and have a great day.